Welcome. This is Melinda Barlow, CZT Certified Zentangle Teacher. And today's lesson is a template. And it's free on my website. You go into the um, free area where you see what's free and you'll find this particular template um, this month. For the rest of the month and probably for quite some time. I love this template. And it's Find Joy, Love Jesus, Love Others, Love Yourself. And I just thought it was beautiful. My daughter had it in her bathroom when I saw it and I fell in love with it. But we're going to do a couple of different things. We're going to color the letters before we start to tangle. So we're going to have a lesson on coloring the letters and then we want them to dry. And then I will do... Um, a lesson on tangling but if you get ahead and want to go ahead and um, color yours in in advance that's fine so I am using a I, I did the F already and I'm using uh, color pencils and you can use any color pencil that you have um, because this method will work with any color pencil um, just different color pencils have more pigma in them and I really like the a Prismacolor uh, color pencil so that's what I'm using and you can get the colors that I'm using you can get them on my website if you want I ha I don't have a lot of these colors I just have a few that I like but you can use any color pencil and then we're going to use um, to blend it we're going to use odorless paint thinner or low odor paint thinner and any brand will do Let's see if I can come in a little bit on this so you can see it. So that's the low odor paint thinner that you um, use. I I use it because it doesn't have a smell, but it blends beautifully. Matter of fact, I like the smell of odor of paint thinner because when I was a young girl, excuse me, when I was a young girl, my mother would um, oil paint, and so when she would paint, it was just she was always in a happy mood and it just made me feel happy so we're going to um, use those I smear it with I have it in a little tiny tub with a sponge in it and you can get those on my website if you want and I use a um, paper um, a tortellone um, which is a rolled up piece of paper or smudger and I dip it in my odorless paint thinner so I'm just going to show you on eye what I've done so I'm going to have to turn this because I did the F so I'm going to turn this so it's going this way so that I don't have my hand in on top of that F that I just did so I'm just going to do the eye and I'm going to do all the find in um, this blue it's called denim blue and um, it goes great with, there's, a, I've got a, a pen that's this color and, and I like to shade with it. But we're just going to start out and I'm just going to put a little bit of blue. Just, you can see, I just put a small amount. And I have to turn my paper. And I just put it just along the line. So I'm just going to come down. And I'm just going to draw that down along that line. And then I'm going to put a little bit right at the top of here. So I'll follow that line in so I've got some there. And I'm going to put some right here. We'll see how that turns out. Now I'm going to take my paper shader. And when you order um, pencils or pens on my shop, you get one of these free with your each pen. Because I think it's so important to, um, to shade. So now we just dipped it in the odorless paint thinner. And you can see how that just blends. Let me see if I can come in a little closer on that eye and I'm just going to blend that blue
and I want it to just kind of blend in. I don't want it to be solid color. And then I might need a little bit more. I'm going to put my uh, odorless paint thinner over here so I can dip into it. And I don't want it to be solid. I want it to have some um, shading in it. So that's why you see that I have just done it a little bit. So I leave that little extra space to, um, to give it some dimension. So I'm going to go ahead and do the N and the D. I'm going to scan out now so you can see. And I'm going to go ahead and do those two and then we'll let it dry and then we'll tangle on that. But you can see I'm just putting a little tiny bit And the fun thing about this, if you don't have enough, say you, well, we'll watch and see if I have enough in there. Um, you can go back and add a little bit more. Moisten my shading stump. And then start to blend. Um, and I'm just going to... I've tried this with um, watercolor pencils. And... Um, I, it's just not as satisfied as I am with the odorless paint thinner. I just like the way this works for me. You could probably do the same thing with a, with a watercolor pencil and water. But just put down a little bit. One thing about the odorless paint thinner is it doesn't warp your paper and water can kind of warp your paper a little bit. But use what you have if you want to. Once you've downloaded the free template and printed it, um, Use whatever you have to color with. I like th that I can have really a lot of control for those fine lines that are on this particular template. Because there's some really fine little lines. So there's the N. And we're going to do some really simple plain tangles in this. And then again I'm going to moisten my um, little a shading stump. And sometimes I will get heavy handed and the end of that stump gets um, push down in and I saw this great idea you can take. This is a paper clip that I've just unfolded. And you see I just put a tiny bit of 
pencil down there and it really spreads. And if you find it's not spreading, add a little bit of more odorless paint thinner. And there we have Find. And now I'm going to do Joy, and I'm going to use pink and blue mixture. So you can mix your pencils. So I'm going to put a little pink down. And then I'm going to put a little blue. I think I want to add a little pink over here. And that was a little bit but you can see what that mixture does and then once we tangle over the top of that it's going to be gorgeous and we're going to do that on the O and the Y but you can mix your colors that kind of helps them blend And I dip frequently to make sure that that is really moist. <clears throat> and now the Y. Move that up a little bit. And here we go to blend it. And now we have Find Joy, and we could color in the um, Jesus and Our and Your, I mean others, Jesus, others, and Your, but maybe we won't. We'll see what happens. Now, we need to let this dry, and then we'll come back and we'll tangle. 